four generations of bakers dating back to the 1900s, my great-grandfather. But more to the point, it's a family business in more than who owns the business, it's franchisees. Uh, they are now the face of our business and where 50 years ago it was players behind the counter serving, it's now franchisees. We really enjoy Ferguson Player Bakehouses as a franchise. Um, the family are lovely people, easy to work with, and we also enjoy interacting with customers, customer service. We do all the baking ourselves and if you go down into our baking facility you can see the guys who are making the pies, there's brothers, there's cousins. We've got a guy who's been with us for 48 years, he worked for my grandfather, he worked for my father, he now works for my brother and myself. Uh, his daughter worked for us, we've got people who met at work, they got married at work. It's a family business in so much more than just the Player family and that's why it's important the way that we uh, run our operation, particularly in a franchise space, it needs to be an extended family. Uh, that comes with all the values and it, become, it comes with all the, the truth and the honesty that you need in a family business and we make sure that that's embedded in the process and the relationships that we have. It's all about support but it's all about calling a spade a spade so that we can move forward and we can live with each other and make the most of the relationships. Ferguson Player is very family orientated and is like a big community. They do make us feel like family, they do make us feel like one big community and to work as one big team. Our best franchisees are the ones that sell happiness. Not just in the product and not just the amazing birthday cake, but they sell happiness in the sense that the customers turned up and said, I'm at Ferguson Player. I know that Anita here knows my name and she's going to ask about my daughter. I know that they're going to start making my coffee exactly the way that I like it before I've even got to the counter. Uh, and they know what I've done on the weekend and they're going to ask about it. And when I leave with my coffee and my donut, um, I'm leaving with a lot more than the product and the fact that I'm going to enjoy this a little bit later on. I'm going to unconsciously have really enjoyed the experience that I just had when I went into the store. They're the kind of franchisees that we want and we need. So franchising is about being in business for yourself, not by yourself. Every good franchisor has their franchisees backs. They always do and they need to and anyone who isn't thinking about that might have a little bit of short term gain uh, but for long term pain and I've got to say that being in a business for four generations, not personally but, uh, but through the family, you don't get to say that you've been in business for 100 years without respecting relationship and without having real foresight around what does the world look like in 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, 100 years in our case. We want to be around in another 100 years. We want to have happy franchisees. We want them to be part of the story that we're going to be telling in 100 years. We don't get to do that if we don't do our jobs properly right now and develop relationships that are great. The Ferguson Player Excellence Training Program, they've got a new 10-star program that they've brought in just recently and it's just to help all franchisees and new franchisees run their company easier and to be more familiar from the get-go. Having support from the actual company is, it plays a major role for us. Um, because we're brand new in the food industry as well, we need a lot of help, um, a bit of guidance about what actually we need to do and they've been there from the very start. So ever since we signed and, and did some training, they've always been here. We don't have business development managers, we have coaches because it's a more appropriate word for the service that we provide. The coach is really going to be their MVP for the rest of their journey, their most valuable person in the business. So you go through your training and then there's formal handover to your coach and that happens before you open your store. So your coach will then work with you around making sure the opening campaign's right. Coaches will work with you around your local demographics to make sure that you've gone and spoken to the local police station, the fire station, you've spoken to the council, you've met with some of the light industrial businesses around your business, so that when you open, you've already got a bit of a captured audience. We have a business coach called Kevin. He's just joined us recently and he's been fantastic. We call him whenever we have a problem, we bounce our ideas off him, uh, strategies, whatever we have a problem with, he's always here ready to help us. Yes, it does make a big difference having someone there to watch our back. Whenever we need anything, we know we've got someone to rely on, someone we can call, and someone that's there that can help solve our problems if we can't solve them. We would recommend Ferguson Player as a franchise to anyone. Anyone that we know that wants to start a business. Um, you can't get much better than the family-run business. 
the environment, the support, quality of the food, and just the name. I mean, there's nothing more you can ask for. It, it's, the, it's the best package to get into.